Hi, I'm Danny Bayard from Club Bremen Spotlight. Welcome to another edition. And I'm sitting in the most gracious, comfortable home there is. It's an old home from 1925 with Annie Blake. Danny, nice to see you. Owner of Death and Glory Restaurant. And you have got to come to this place. This is, it's, it's very unique. So I'm going to ask you some questions. Sure. When did you guys start this restaurant? So Death or Glory opened in April of 2017. And I understand that this particular home has a really cool, unique history. Tell us about that. It does. Uh, this is the old Falcon House. It's historic. It was built in 1925 by E.C. Hall, who built the Delray Theater. In the early 1940s, he sold the house to the Falcon family, and the Falcon family lived there for, I believe, nearly 50 years. They owned Falcon Drugs on Atlantic Avenue. Okay, and at one point, it was converted to a restaurant instead of a home. Right, so I believe in the early to mid 90s it was converted to an Italian restaurant um, and then it was most sort of known for in the past a bar called the Falcon House and Restaurant, okay. which we like to play, play a little homage to here as well. Um, and then it was a few restaurants after that and now it's us. You have got to see the photos on the wall, there's originals of the original family. I think that like these photos, which you guys can't see, but it'll be coming up soon. Uh, who are they? So we have a lot of our family in, um, in this house. I think a lot of what my business partner, Amy Harrison, and I thought in terms of bringing this house back to life was to bring it back to the era in which it shined the best, right? So um, she and, and my family both keep great historical records, and so we had a lot of pictures from the late 1920s until the early 1940s, and so we put our families up, her cousin, her parents, her grandparents, my aunt, and a number of my family and cousins as well. If you love antique photos, you got to come to this place. Now, tell me about Annie. She's not here today, but Amy, you, yeah. Amy I'm sorry. And yeah. you guys met how? Amy and I met uh, six or seven years ago at a conference called Tales of the Cocktail in New Orleans. It's a cocktail convention for the trade every year. About 20,000 cocktail bartenders come out and spend the week together and learn and drink and have a great time. And um, she had owned Creepy Tiki in Fort Lauderdale okay. at that time. And my boss at Cocktail Kingdom, where I also work, had uh, mentioned that she and I should meet. And so we hooked up with Tales of the Cocktail. I thought she was a little too cool for me. <laughs> and so it took a minute <laughs> for and anyone who knows Amy. She's definitely cooler than I am. <laughs> um, it took a minute, but we ended up, we kept reconnecting, running in the same circles and realized we had a lot more in common than we thought. Hard to imagine anybody cooler than you are, but we'll, <laughs> we'll definitely hard. have to meet Annie. <laughs> yeah. Tell us about the food. So our food is, uh, Chef Alex Arlinga uh, curates our menu. He's incredibly talented. And he, um, we do new American food, some global influences, seasonal food. We have a small menu. We're in a 100-year-old home, so we have a small kitchen. Um, but if anyone were to walk around and look, our freezer is not much bigger than the freezer you'd have in your house. Wow. So everything's That's fresh. Challenging. Yeah, yes. everything's fresh, which is nice. So while we don't have a million things, we have something for everyone, and you, you know that it's not been sitting in the back freezer for six months, right? And I want you to tell us about these new drinks that you guys have uh, It actually invented during the COVID crisis. Yeah, we did. So um, obviously we've had to pivot quite a bit with the coronavirus this year. And to-go cocktails have been really fun for us, for people to be able to come and have a cocktail without having to fear sitting close to people, as well as um, you know us to reconnect with our guests who maybe don't feel like going out. And so we made these boozy shakes when everything first shut down, which were so much fun. And I couldn't believe how many people needed comfort food, right? <laughs> um, now that we're into summer, though, we've got these fabulous uh, Nonino spritzers, which are fantastic. It's a, it's a new Nonino aperitivo. It's a botanical. It's low ABV, and it also has some club soda and some, some bubbles in there. And we have uh, grapefruit and mint, thyme and lemon and strawberry and basil flavors. They're $7, and they stand up on their own. They come in this cute little package. Um, and they're super refreshing. Refreshing. They look refreshing. They, they are. look yummy. Now, Death and Glory is a COVID-19 compliant restaurant. And uh, they got these great little posters. I picked one up. It's a PSA announcement. Pants are optional. Masks aren't. Show your ass. 
but don't be one. So <laughs> That's right. We, we were compliant. We got here with masks. We're socially distanced. And, uh, you know, I really want to congratulate you for being an entrepreneur during this. You know, Thank you. I see social Thank distancing. You. I see the tables are arranged differently. Yes. You've got some uh, some blow-up dolls for the oh, ones yeah. that can or cannot. Yeah, the little Our friends there. Our friends. Yeah, so instead They're of allowed having to sit it cordoned bar. off in police tape, they've got yeah. uh, uh, little friends uh, all over the seats. And yeah. I see, hear yeah. about friends. And yes. I've heard this. Now, you got to confirm it for me. Is this place haunted? Yeah, I mean, I would say so. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the thing. You can't have a nearly 100-year-old house without walls that talk, right? Um, we've, had, we've had quite a few things. Um, probably the biggest one, a lot of my staff has been here since day one. And uh, we have glasses in the back at the server station. And after closing, more than one of them have seen glasses fly straight across the oh room. Oh my gosh. What about um, yourself? Have you ever seen anything kind of creepy? Yeah, I mean, the doors open and close fairly often, more often than you'd probably feel comfortable with if you were terribly afraid of ghosts. Um, but Amy and I, honestly, like, I wish these walls could talk. And, you know, whoever's here hanging out with us, we feel like they've got a home and they should stay stick around and, and they're like good to that. us and we're cool to them. It's yeah. part of the uniqueness of this yeah, particular sure. location for and sure. venue. It's got a lot of history and so I'm sure somebody, plus it's a cool little house, who wouldn't want to stick around? Talk to us about the different rooms. So um, one of the things I like about Death or Glory the best actually is that every little place feels different. Um, so we have our dining room, which feels a little bit more formal. Then we have our lounge, which feels, uh, we like it to feel like kind of a 1920, 1930s living room. We have our in-house, our falcon room, which is our private in-house dining room with its beautiful old curtains. And then outside, we have our patio seating out front. But then if you sneak around the back of the house and go through the carport, we have our tiki bar in the back, which is maybe my favorite place in the bar. I, I, I think it's so cool. You go through yeah. each room. They each have a personality. They do. I definitely want they you do. guys to get a close-up of this old fireplace, the original fireplace of what I understand. Yes, of it the was house. the original fireplace in the house. It, it doesn't work anymore, but um, I'm sure it, it heated up many a pot in its day. I bet. Yeah. I bet. So, Death and Glory, located off of Federal Highway and Northeast 6th Street. Is that correct? Northeast 6th Avenue at 1st Street. Northeast 6th Avenue is Federal Highway here in Delray, Federal Highway North, and we're just a block north of Atlantic. And tell us when you're open. We are open Tuesday through Sunday uh, from 12 to 11 for takeout and from 4 to 11 for uh, in-house dining. Obviously, we're limited seating inside, socially distanced outside. We have all the hand sanitizers and all of the things to make Obviously, people feel comfortable. I see it all over. Um, if you don't have a mask, we'll be happy to give you one. Well, there you go. And um, and we hope to see you. And we're www.deathorglorybar.com. Uh, you can also order online for pickup uh, or delivery. And do you have and, a phone uh, number you want to tell us about? Absolutely. 561-808-8814. You can always also email me, Annie, A-N-N-I-E, at deathorglorybar.com. All right. So we got all that contact information right there scrolling on the screen. And don't forget, we've got a very special uh, Club Brayman discount. I hope to see you guys. All right. What yeah. is that Club Brayman discount anyway? It is 15% discount Ooh. for everything, for everybody who comes in. Yeah, right. we'd love to see you. Everybody who drives a Brayman car. I know I do. All right. I tell me about BMW. your Brayman car. So I'm on my second 230i BMW. Um, my little, I call it my Barbie car. <laughs> it feels like a Barbie car to me. I had white before and now I'm on silver. Uh, both convertibles? Both convertibles. Wow, okay. Yeah. The 230 and is stuck. It's. I love that. My sister, who lives in L.A., now drives the car. And uh, she saw mine. She loved it so much that she got the same car as, as I have. And um, my husband drives a BMW as well. But I, I'm so s stuck on that car. I don't think I'll ever... I'll get a new one, but I'm not going to get a different one. <laughs> a BMW family. I'm sitting with Annie Blake from Death and Glory Restaurant. you got to come and check this place out. Just for the nostalgia of it. Come by, have a drink. But as soon as you see the menu, you're going to want something. All right. Once again, Club Brayman. This is Danny Bayard for Club Brayman Spotlight. See you soon. Thank you, Annie. Danny. Thank it's been you. a pleasure. Thank it's you. It's been our pleasure, too.